In today's mobility training tip, we will be covering part four of our dynamic nervous system integration work, focusing on our feet for proprioception, balance, and coordination and reaction time of our ground base structure, our feet. So again, we're gonna take these two pipes that we've had, okay? And now we're gonna really challenge ourselves here. Before we've had some bases of support. With this, you can, you can have the two sticks like I've talked about in some of the blog posts here, okay? But for me, I've advanced where I don't need those so much. So I'm putting pressure on myself saying that. But you're gonna balance on these pipes here. So if you hone in on my feet, notice I'm really spreading my toes here. They're not just next to each other, but they're spread. And I'm really gripping this pipe here. They're straight on there. And now I'm gonna just move the pipe forward. Just walking forward with it. Now I'm making this actually look pretty easy because I've been practicing this for a while, okay? But it's much harder than it looks. So you wanna think about getting up on your toes here and use those toes to glide it back. Then you put your weight down and you glide this back. There's gonna be a lot of trial and error. You know, to be able to stand up here, even with two sticks, it's gonna make it hard for you to move on this, essentially. You'll be able to just get up here and just be like, oh, I'm not falling. You know, I'm pretty well practiced, so I'm making this look much easier than it really is. But we're just gliding forward. And this can be harder when there's less friction on the ground here. So we got a rug here, so there's a little bit of friction. If I were to do this, say, on the mats in the jiu-jitsu gym, it'd be much harder. It'd be a little more wobbly. So take that into consideration when you're training this. So again, we're just going forward here, and then we're going backwards. It's kind of like we're moonwalking, okay? But with this, focus on spreading those toes, gripping with those toes. These toes are meant to work. Let's think of it this way for a moment. We put our feet in gloves all the time, basically. Shoes. Would you do that with your hands? Would you wear gloves all day long and expect your hands to be able to work right? No. So why do we do that with our feet? Why allow those feet to work like feet. Allow those toes to feel. Allow like, yourself to actually feel that big toe, what it's doing. You don't want it to be numb. You want those nerve endings, your feet, those are sensory receptors. Those are there for you to be able to feel what's going on in the environment. And the more that you feel what's going on, whatever sport, in life, you're just looking for increased health, take care of your feet. You're going to be able to take in a lot more. You're going to be a lot healthier. You can perform a lot better. Guys, if you found this video helpful, connect with me on the platforms below, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Reddit. I'm also on Reddit. Like, subscribe, comment, let me know how it goes. I'm here to help you. Peace.